what's going on guys <laughs> i can't do it anyways thank you guys so much for the love that you guys have shown on the dark season one um episodes once they hit youtube um this will be on early access this week so for you guys that are watching on early access congratulations anyways um but as far as i know if you guys gonna have to wait you know you guys waited a week to see this on the channel and i appreciate you guys for for waiting around i'm gonna try to have season three done so you guys can get to 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 have to see it like the next week after you don't have to wait on the youtube channel but early access for season two will be this week and i might just do season three doing during the week this week along with sons of anarchy and just put out season three for for every, um for the early access people over the weekend so they can get to binge um season three over the weekend because what i've been doing with early access is the same thing i'm doing like giving them two episodes for early access every day but i might just bypass that um so we will be all caught up with the show and blah blah, blah. but anyways let's talk about dark this show is you guys saw how much i rave about this show that it's already in my top five and the reason for that is because i enjoy this genre so much um i like the idea behind it now we gonna jump we we, we we gonna jump in because um it's been a good while since i've actually i mean it's been around two to three weeks since i saw season one so i'm gonna have to be reminded of some things i do remember um some things that were taking place i do remember those things but i'm a little fuzzy on the names and i think everything is going to come back to me as soon as i start watching the show because it's been a while since i watched the show so um you know i can't i can imagine the people who had to wait a whole year to watch another to watch the second season i don't you get what i'm saying but i do on it because there's so much things going on there's so many things that are connected that you got to connect the dots to and see what's going on so i do remember what's going on with jonas jonas's um character katarina um ulrich uh, i remember the character some of the characters name hannah was jonas's mom the, you know back in the past whatever mikhail ended up being jonas's dad and all of this other stuff everything is kind of connected but the most interesting thing about this entire show that i want to know is who the hell is noah man <laughs> like who is this dude and what is his significance around this entire thing? Is he the one orchestrating this entire thing? They said there's some sort of war going on over time travel and all of this other stuff. It, you, you know, there's so many intriguing things that is going on in this show. And there's a, a lot of it I'm going to have to be reminded of, of course, as I said before. So we're just going to jump in, man. Short intro. If you guys are watching this on the YouTube channel, please consider signing up for early access because i will be um or i'm considering doing season three um and releasing it early for the early reactors and then we'll continue with the same method for the youtube channel with two episodes per day so i'm looking forward to that anyways let's jump in and i will see you guys for the review all right so dark season two episodes one and two um still in the dark about a lot of things the mystery behind this show is very potent you know what i'm saying like it's there you want to know so bad about what's going on i think the most mysterious thing about this entire thing is the whole the noah storyline I'm gonna talk about that a little bit like they introduce a new character which is adam i didn't even know that noah was looking to someone and as i said during the episode i'm wondering if they're taking this from a from a biblical point of view where with those with that part of it where you have a um a adam and a noah because adam was like the first was 
the, the first man then Noah was like the second man because it was after everything was wiped away and they start over with who was on the ark including the, and the animals right so I'm wondering if that's how Noah got his name but it seems like there's um, but I'm also wondering if Adam is another Noah I'm wondering if it's that's him in, in, in older but it wouldn't make sense because it wouldn't make sense because he's a lot shorter and he's not younger you get what I'm saying so it wouldn't make sense for them to to do that in casting they would have cast them probably around the same height to not confuse anyone um, so I don't think it's the same person I do think that the younger Noah from 1921 or whatever um, is you know the same Noah and they both you know you're talking to your future self talking to your young your, your older self whatever the situation is this that's what I think of that I think that's the most intriguing storyline that's going on right now everything is connected don't get me wrong not because I'm saying you know that storyline or this storyline or this storyline all of it is connected and you know seeing things from their perspective about what's going on you know Jonah's coming back you know as he's older coming back to see the moms taking the moms back to see who her husband was to, to show it i hey, Mikael became your husband you know what i'm saying how you guys met and blah 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 you know i'm from school and from 1986 and all of this other stuff like it's all coming together you know what i'm saying it's all coming together so i'm looking for i mean it's just the first two episodes of the season so you can you, you know you can find time to kind of establish certain storylines and stuff like that it's only eight i didn't even notice that it's only eight episodes for the season i didn't even realize that i thought it was going to be 10 again but it's only eight i haven't checked season three to see how much episodes it's going to be so um it's eight episodes but i'm still gonna do you're still gonna get the episodes two at a time you know um and then we'll just end on a thursday or whatever at two at a time but we'll see how that works out so got the situation going over there the the one that's happening in the apocalyptic future where jonas just left i'm wondering about it you get what i'm saying because it's like okay this is after everything goes belly up so i'm wondering what is this event that happened that caused the 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 start over you know what i'm saying that is seemingly being orchestrated by adam like what what happened we want to know what happens in these six days that happen in these six days um where this apocalyptic event happened that changed the world into what it is now where it's just empty so i'm wondering if the nuclear plant blew up and just eviscerated Winden. that's what i'm wondering if that's what happened but how would it seemed like deaf girl survived um i don't remember her name um charlotte's daughter right seems like she survived at least and it seems like more people survived so i'm wondering if this is a world thing that happened or this just happened in Winden. you know what i'm saying so um so yes there's still a lot of questions to be asked when it comes on to this series you're never going to be short of questions like you know what i'm saying um the situations that are taking place seems like some people are still you know um dealing with certain things in their personal life the kids are kind of like left on like a kid's level which is fine i'm good with that because they don't really know what's going on they're just dealing the only one that's really knows kind of knows what's going on because i don't think he fully knows what's going on um is bartush you know what i'm saying i think he, uh, bartos i should say bartos bartush bartush i think he's the only one that actually knows kind of what's going on he's the one that's privy you know what I'm to what's going on him and, and Jonas is playing a way bigger part in the series more than more than all the kids um Mikkel he's been thrown back in the past but he still don't really know what's going on he kind of has an idea or, or you know he knows that he's been thrown back in the past but he doesn't know how to deal with it so he just has to just go along with what's going on 
you know what I'm saying? Um, so I'm wondering how Hannah is going to react if Jonas, you know, future Jonas is going to show his mom a lot more than just that and just take her back just to let he, he's just showing her like he, he realizes that what he did before didn't change anything. So he's trying things a little bit differently, it seems. So I'm here for it, man. I'm ready to see what Dark has to offer this season with six more episodes to go. I'm going to try to knock those out so you guys will have them for early access um, this upcoming week. And also um, for you guys to have them, you know, on the, on the channel for everybody else next week. Um, so we'll see how things go. I'm going to try to knock those out for you guys um, and get them ready for y'all. So make sure you're prepared, make sure you're ready because your boy is out here grinding for y'all. So if you guys, you guys already know, um, when it comes on to memberships on the channel, if you want to see these reactions, early reactions, um, it's only $2 guys. Um, go ahead and sign up for the membership. It's the second tier on the channel. If you don't see the join button, the link is in the description and it's the first one under um, donate or support the channel. I don't remember what exactly <laughs> I have it there, but all the links are under there from the PayPal to the to the Patreon to the to the um, to the memberships that I just added. So make sure you go and check that out. If so, if you don't feel like doing that, fine. You only have to wait a wait a week to watch them on the channel so don't worry about it and i'm currently trying to find a situation to, to solve the google drive situation so hey i appreciate you guys as always man you already know leave a like on on this video and leave a comment of course let me know what you're thinking this series is fire you guys know how much i'm enjoying it the reveals are just mind-blowing especially the, the the i think the the one where i can't remember her name why am I blanking on her name right now? What Regina's mom, man. Regi Regina's re reg Regina. Regina's mom. Regina. <laughs> Regina's mom. I can't I don't remember her name, but um yeah. So totally cool with how they reveal how she was talking to her and she was telling her, hey, we've done this before, you know. You know, but everything has to happen the same way it happened before. Nothing can change, you know. So, hey, we got to figure out. So it's like, it's like they're getting a do over on whatever, you know what I'm saying? They're getting a do over to do things again when it comes on to them. They're trying to stop what Adam has done, which is, um, I don't know if he's the cause of the, the, the apocalypse or whatever. But it seems like he is. But that's this is just my theory. You know what I'm saying? So it seems like he's behind what happens. And it has something to do with Charlotte's grandfather too. But it seems like his the grandfather was a part of whatever Noah and Adam is a part of. You know, so I don't know how that's going to play out. But in any case, guys, I'm signing off. See you guys later because I'm starting to talk and review again. You know, because this show is so many questions. I could sit here for 20, 30 minutes doing a review on on two episodes. It's crazy, you know, but, you know, I'm trying to keep it simple so you guys are not sitting here for another 20, 30 minutes after watching two hours of, you know, the show of seeing me, seeing my reaction. So I'm trying to keep it simple. Anyways, appreciate you guys. Gratitude is never enough. It's your boy, Terabyte Reacts, man. I'm out. Peace. See you guys tomorrow.